Okay, hey guys, what's up? Evil Zombie here. So, today I'm going to review the Nebo N13 um, headset, and I want to give you my thoughts on it, what I think. I've been testing it out, trying it out on different things, and I want to give you my opinion. So, first and foremost, what came in the box? Came with an instruction manual, came with the headset, and also came with an adapter for the TRRS Cable N2. It's a splitter that splits it, the in and out channels, so... It goes to TRS as well, so you can plug it into a computer. This I have plugged into my phone directly. I'm actually able to record it because TRRS can tr have both signals go through one cable, which I think is fantastic. So, let's get into my thoughts on the actual headset. So, comfort. When you think of a headset, you think, like, the big squishy pads and the soft top and all that. How comfortable is it? This is actually pretty comfortable. I like it. It's, um, these are cloth... So, you probably pull, take them off, wash them, all that. But it's comfortable. They, oh, I'll do the other side. Um, they move around, they swivel, and that's nice. This goes up and down. So, it actually kind of just forms to the shape of your head like that. And they're soft. They're really soft. I mean, I actually fell asleep with these on before. They're pretty comfortable. Um, they work pretty well with the VR headset because the big gap up here. So, that's where the head part go. You just clip this over your ear, and they have plenty of room for that. Um, I used them with a uh, Windows Mixed Reality headset. They are great for games. I mean, it's good for doing VR games. It's really comfortable. You just kind of forget they're there, and you can record with the mic if you don't have a lavalier. It's cool. These are great for YouTubers, I'm telling you. Um, comfort. Okay. So, the top squishy pad is also really good. Um, it's a pretty good thick. It's a, not like super thick. It's not super thin. It's a good high density foam. And it actually just sits comfortably on top of your head. It doesn't hurt after a while. It's great. I like it. Um, this, the little mic, um, it actually goes when you fold it up far enough out of your view where it's not in your peripheral anymore. It's not really that intrusive when it's actually out. Like I've seen some where they're like up here. This one's actually just kind of out of the way and you really don't notice it. But check out how far back this one goes. Okay, so that's pretty cool. This headset does not light up. There's no USB component to it. You don't have the extra part of the cables hanging out anywhere. So this is all as it is. But you only have one cable. And it's a nice uh, braided cable as well. I don't know if you guys can see that. Okay, it's focusing on my face. Maybe not. But it's cool. You can also turn off the microphone from there. You can control the volume from there as well. And it feels pretty sturdy. I mean, it's good. Okay, so um, let's get into microphone quality. You can hear it. The entire video is going to be recorded with this microphone with no audio editing. I'm not going to do any kind of um, compression. I'm not going to do any kind of equalization. Nothing like that. No noise removal. No click removal. This is exactly what this microphone sounds like. So, yeah. And also, now we're moving into sound quality for the headphones. How do those sound? Oh, yeah, my thought on the microphone. It's, that's the only downside I can think of, but that's for every headset I've ever tried. I have never in my life seen a good, a good microphone on a gaming headset, and I've even gone with nice Logitech ones before. The mic is still just a headset mic, and that's all there really is to it. So, you get what you expect from a headset mic. That's that's exactly what it is. Um, so we're talking about the sound quality for the earpieces now. These have uh, 50 millimeter drivers, and they sound really good. I was listening to music for a while with these. I've tried a few horror games. But I want to test out audio quality. I go between something with soft piano, that I go to blues, then I go to death metal. then I um, And then I check out a horror game because... Sound is very important in a horror game. Like, if I play Dungeon Nightmares or Dungeon Nightmares 2 on the phone, even, um, sound is key. It's really important. I play, I've played a bit of Vanish with this. I've tried different horror games on VR to see how immersive it is, how everything sounds coming through these. Is it deep? Is it, is it too boomy? No, it's great. It's actually pretty well balanced. It has a good, rich bass. And it never overpowered completely the mids or the highs, so I could still hear them all clearly. You know, music, I love it. These are great. So, sound quality is definitely an A-plus for me. I love it. Um, who would I suggest this to? Well, I would definitely suggest this to YouTubers. 
and just general gamers as well. So YouTubers, I would highly suggest this too, mostly because you have multiple recording options with it. If you don't have a regular microphone, this is basically a small condenser. It's like a little lavalier microphone on a stick, more or less. You can record with it. You can record with it directly in your phone. Uh, most phones now will automatically have like a headset audio mode when you plug in the TRRS cable. And it worked pretty well for me. So you can record games on your phone directly with it, and I think that's great. Um, it's good quality for gaming, so gamers overall. If you like music, these are actually pretty good. I would probably compare the quality of sound to my Sennheiser uh, 202 HD headset headphones. Um, so that's probably about the quality of sound you'll get. I, I, I'm actually liking the quality. So, uh, the other than that, the cable is about five to six feet long, so it's not a long cable. They expect you to be near your source of uh, where your audio is going to be. The cable adapter works well. It does exactly what it goes it sets out to do, and other than that, it's nice. I enjoy the headset, and I highly suggest it. So, there's my thoughts. Bye.